What's good, y'all? It's Juno here, man. Welcome back for another Mail Time Monday, man. This time, if you haven't read the title yet, I got my very first Kuyashi Jewelry Haul video, bruh. Now, I fuck with Kuyashi Heavy. Shout out my boy Connor. What's good, bro? I know you're gonna see this video. Shout out my boy Connor. He is the owner of Kuyashi Jewelry, man. I decided to cop some stuff off of the website, and it finally came, man. I got over $800. Yes, eight big ones. I almost dropped a rack. Over $800. Hundred dollars worth of Kuyashi jewelry, man. Make sure to go shop Kuyashi. I'm gonna be leaving Kuyashi's Instagram and website and Connor's information down in a bow below. So make sure to go follow Kuyashi on Instagram. Go shop Kuyashi jewelry and make sure to get you some heat, man. But that's enough of me talking, bro. Let's see what we got in here, boy. Let's see what we got in these packages. Let's get it. So first up, these are four Kuyashi boxes right here. Like I said, I got a whole lot of stuff. But before we get into these boxes here, we're going to see what's in this package. He left an individual package. He said, hey, yo, Juno, I'm going to leave you a little package to the side. And I'm just going to give you some goodies and, and just some random shit. So first up, we're going to open up this mystery random package. I don't know what's in here. I know what's in the boxes, obviously, because I bought it. But I don't know what's in this package right here. Let's see what the boy Connor, what the homie, gave to me, man. First off, Connor gave me a sticker right here. But on the back of it, he wrote a note to me. I'm going to read this real quick. Let's see what he said. Juno, thank you so much for all your support and love. Deadass, none of it ever goes unnoticed, I swear. Enjoy the drip, free pieces, random stuff, and whatever else the fuck is in this bag. With love, Connor, man. So there goes that note that Connor wrote for me, man. Here goes a sticker right there. It says, Kuyashi Jewelry with the Kuyashi logo. The Ninja Star is Kuyashi's logo right there with a chain chilling on the back of it. And there goes the sticker, Kuyashi Jewelry. He said he left some random stuff in his bag. First up, he left me some candy, bruh. He left me a little candy cane from Christmas. Um, I don't know if I should eat this. Um, but he left me some candy. He knows I like to eat. He knows, you know, I'm a little bit on the thicker side. So he knows I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a bite out of this. But he left me some Listerine. Are you trying to say my breath stink, bro? Come on now, bro. It's, it's kind of mean, bro. <laughs> but anyways... Uh, Okay, don't cry on camera, bro. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> it says here, for your breath, KJ, Kuyashi Jewelry. He said my breath stink, bro. He left me some Listerine gum. Is it gum or chewable tablets? Ready to go tabs, Listerine. Chew, swish, swallow. Oh, wow. He left me this because my breath stink, I guess. But there you go, he left me some list. Oh, shit. He left me some Listerine, bro. He left me a Supreme Parachute, bruh. I remember when this dropped. This was a free gift on the first week of Fall Winter 2019. So there goes the Supreme Parachute. I was talking about a little soldier parachute guy. I'm not gonna open it up, but there goes that. So he gave me a paper clip, bruh. This is a Sterling Silver 0.925 paper clip. Like, I don't... I don't really know what I'm going to do with this. It doesn't work like a real, like, like a bend it. I don't want to bend it like that. But, like, I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do with this. Maybe use it as a pendant or something. You know, put on a chain. Use it as a pendant. I'm not sure. But he just gave me a random ass paper clip, bro. He gave me this stainless steel with the gold touch to it or whatever. This chain right here. It's a rope chain. And he gave me this ring. This right here is a curb link ring, I believe. I'm not really sure what kind of link or chain it is or whatever. But you can see in the ring, let me try to look for it right there. If you can see right there, it's a little messed up inside the little ring link right there. So he told me that this ring did not pass the quality check. So he didn't put this up for sale. But nonetheless, the ring still goes hard. Boom, if it's right there on my finger. This actually might be a little too small for me. 
This might be a, li a little too smidgy small. Here goes that rejected ring. I still think it goes hard, but you can clearly see where it's a little messed up right there in the link part. And then he gave me this rope chain right here. It is a stainless steel chain and it's got that gold touch to it. I don't know why this chain didn't pass the quality check or whatever, but there goes that gold touch stainless steel rope chain, man. There goes everything that I got in this mystery package right here. Just a little recap. We got the Supreme Boy. We got Listerine because my breath stinks. We got a paper clip in stainless steel that goes crazy. We got this, you feel me? We got a little sticker with a little heartfelt note in the middle of it. We got the Go Touch chain right there. And then we got this curb link chain, curb chain link ring thing. Ing, bling, 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 bagal. So that goes everything that was in this little package that he just threw in there for me. He was just like, "Look, bro, I'm just give you all this little random stuff just, just, just cause I feel like it, really." So that's everything that he gave. Now we're gonna get actually into the jewelry that I bought. Like I said, over 800 big ones, 800 dollars worth of jewelry, man. Let's see what's in these boxes. First, we're going to get into the two lighter boxes and then the two heavier ones. Let's see what's in these bad boys right here. First up, here goes the design of the box. And it has that Kuyashi Ninja Star on every single box. Every single box has it right there. So there goes the packaging, man. In here, we got the little packaging bag that it comes in. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. So in here, we got a little baggie right there, as well with the Kuyashi logo of the Ninja Star. It's on the baggie. This is that velvet. It feels nice. That all cream white with the black Kuyashi star, as well as in the bottom of the box, it goes another Kuyashi jewelry sticker, the same one he wrote a note on. And it comes with this little cloth as well to clean your jewelry. It's hard to see on the camera, but it also has that Ninja Star Kuyashi logo. Every single box has the exact same layout. It comes with the jewelry inside of this bag, and under it, it has a little cleaning thing and a sticker. But that's enough of me explaining the packaging, even though I appreciate it. Let's see what I actually got, man. First up, we got this Murakami-inspired piece right here. This was a chain and pendant bundle, actually. Everything else, I bought the chain and the pendants individually. But this was a bundle right there. It's got that darkened look to it. It's stainless steel, but it's got that darkened look to it. It's not like, you know, shiny, shiny. It's darkened. And if you don't know who Murakami is, if you've never heard of Murakami, bruh, do your research. Murakami is one of the GOATs when it comes to artwork and changing the game of streetwear and all that good stuff. So this is inspired by that. It's a Murakami logo. So this is the first piece, man. Here goes the second piece. It is a Molotov. It's got some gems right there on the fire. So that's how you make the fire look or whatever with some cool gems. That's pretty lit. And it's got the Kuyashi star on the bottle right there. Another cool thing about this is the part that goes in the chain is actually openable like that. So you can open it up kind of like an earring or something. You can open it up and close it right there. That's pretty cool that you can undo the little part right there so that you don't actually got to take off the chain if you just want to switch the pendant or something like that. And then I got this one with a rope chain. Rope chains are my absolutely favorite type of chains to wear with pendants. I just think they just look nice. They look nice and sleek. And so I bought this rope chain separately just to rock with the Molotov pendant right there. This right here is the second to last piece that I'm going to be showing on the first box. It is a butterfly knife, man. The cool thing about this butterfly knife, you can wear it different ways. You can wear it this way like this, right? Or you can wear it like this, dangling off of one end. So you can wear it like that if you want. And there's a third way you can wear it too. Or you can wear it like this with it closed. So those are the three ways that you can wear this one pendant. I think that's super dope like that that honestly when I first saw it I was like what the hell what kind of what what kind of sorcery is that bruh but you can wear it like this it also has I don't know if you can see it but it's got the Kuyashi Ninja Star right there on the side of it and it says 925 on the other side of it 
showing that this is 0.925 sterling silver, man. This will never, ever, ever. All of this jewelry that I've showed so far will never go green on you. You can shower with it. You can go swimming with it. Wearing these pieces that I got on me right now, they'll never turn anything green, bro. You good. Personally, I'm going to be wearing mine like this. To me, this is the coolest version or whatever that you can wear it. But if you decide to get this Kuyashi butterfly knife pendant, you know that you can rock it three different ways. Whatever way is your favorite. This right here is the very last piece that I'll be showing on the first box. It is that iced out Kuyashi logo right there with an iced out tennis chain man now if you've seen my other jewelry haul videos like my hard jewelry one or my personal fears one or whatever other video that i have jewelry in it you notice i barely buy anything really shiny like this everything i get is like this stainless steel or sterling silver i don't really get nothing iced out but I decided to get this iced out tennis chain, man, with this iced out Kuyashi pendant right there. It's so shiny. Just look at it. Oh my gosh. Look at the shine on that bad boy. Just look at the way that it's just sparkling in the light. I got my phone up top right now with my flashlight on. Just look at that. Oh my gosh. It's so beautiful. The camera can't even center on it because it's just... <laughs> It's so nice. It's so pretty. <sighs> so here goes a little recap of everything I got. I decided to put on a black shirt just because it's easier to see everything on a black shirt on. With a white shirt, it's a little more difficult. But first up, we got that Iced Out Kuyashi logo with the Iced Out tennis chain right there we got the molotov pendant with the little gems for the fire on the side there we got the butterfly knife pendant right there and then we got the murakami pendant with the chain right there man i love everything that i got right here it's all so nice i'm not used to having real shiny stuff like this one but it it looks real good you feel me my hair's a mess but it looks real good on me you dig Make sure to comment down below your favorite item that I got in the first box. So the second box, like I said earlier as well, comes with the little baggie right there, the little cleaning cloth and the sticker. But I took everything out of the baggie. Let's see what was in the box. It is mostly rings, man. I love rings. I don't got enough of them. But for the most part, I wear little chains, like skinny chains with pendants. So I needed some more rings. I'm about to step up and level up my ring game. So the first ring I'm showing today is this gator ring, man. Now, I am part of the gator gang, boy. I went to SF State. I mean, technically, I'm still enrolled, but I'm not really taking classes right now. So, like, en enough of the little details, you feel me? But the mascot of San Francisco State University is the Gators, man. So, I was like, let me get this gator ring right there. And, man, this ring is nice. This comes in that stainless steel. It's got a darkened touch to it. So, it's not really super shiny. It's dark all around. But there goes the gator, man, wrapping around. This right here reminds me of my slime ring. This is my slime ring from Hard Jewelry. If you haven't watched any of my Hard Jewelry hauls or watched the one where I opened up this slime ring, I suggest you go do that as soon as you're done watching this video. But anyways, both of these have a similar design. They kind of have two parts to the ring, and they both wrap around your finger. So the slime ring right there wraps around the finger right there. And then the gator ring, it wraps around on that side. So there goes that gator ring. This is the first ring that I'm be showing today. Here goes the second ring. It is an iced out Cuban ring, man. It's hard to see with the camera just because, you know, the lighting isn't the best and the camera is hard to focus on it. But there goes that iced out Cuban ring. It goes hard. He's got a bunch of iced out rings and pendants. This was the only one that I really, really, really fuck with. And like I said, I don't wear a whole lot of shiny jewelry like that. But I decided to get this one, man. I was like, this one is nice. It's got on the face of every single Cuban link. Because if you don't know how Cubans work, they're, I'm not going to explain it. Just look up a Cuban link chain and look into it. The face of it is flat 
and on every single link the face has them iced out kuyashi man so there goes that ring this right here is the last ring that i bought but there's actually one more ring in here that i gotta show but this is the last one that i actually bought that i got i got that star power ring i thought it was pretty cool it's a simple ring you feel me i'm gonna be a star one day hopefully so i got this ring right there so this was actually given to me by connor as a gift this is a baguette zipper ring man connor he loves this ring when i saw it i thought it was dope as fuck but i didn't want to get it i was like you know what i'm not gonna get this one maybe next time but i know that connor loves this one so he threw it in there on the little zipper tag thing right there it's got the kuyashi star it's a little hard to see i just wanted to show all the rings real quick we got the ice style cuban ring we got the gator ring we got the star power ring that's not the name of it but that's what i like to call it we got the baguette zipper ring right there and we got the rejected curb link ring i just wanted to show all of it real quick this is not how i'm gonna be wearing all of this jewelry i'm not gonna be wearing it all together like this but i just want to show it real quick it's so nice and look at the shine on it bro it can't even focus on it the camera don't even know where to focus but there goes all the rings we got one more piece we got a chain that was also given as a gift last but not least connor gave me this piece right here for free it is a figaro chain link right there if you don't know what a figaro chain is like it's like one two three big one two three big I, that's how i explain it there goes that chain right there i decided to use the figaro chain and put the paper clip on it as a pendant man i don't know what i was gonna do with the chain i don't know what i was gonna do with the paper clip I could have worn the chain just by itself, but I don't know. I like to put pendants on my chain. So here goes that little paper clip pendant on it, man. That goes so hard. So here goes everything that I got so far. Just to recap, okay? We got the Gator Ring, Star Ring, Zipper Ring, Iced Cuban Ring. We got the Rejected Link Ring. I forgot what kind of link. I forgot, but we got that. You feel me? We got all this right here. We got kuyashi logo iced out we got molotov bottle right there we got the figaro chain that he gave for free with the paper clip he gave for free right there we got the murakami inspired piece right there and then what else we got i know we got one more i think uh, uh, uh where's it at uh and then we got this butterfly knife piece right there and then we just got the gold touch stainless steel road chain by itself right there man we're done almost okay i know it's been a long video but bear with me we only got two more items man we got two more boxes before we get into the last two pieces make sure to leave a comment down below what was your favorite item that i've gotten so far maybe comment your favorite pendant and your favorite ring or just comment your favorite item. Maybe it was the list of ring because my breath stink. I don't know. But leave a comment down below your favorite item that I got so far. But we got two more items now. Let's see what we got in this box right here. So here goes the second to last piece that I'll be showing today. It is this Cuban chain. It is bigger than this chain right here. This is my hard jewelry chain that I wear literally every single day for the last year and a few months but here goes an even bigger thicker heavier cuban chain and it's got that blue icy touch to it oh my gosh i believe this is enamel that's on top of the chain this is so heavy bro like oh my gosh but you can hear how icy it is man there goes that blue enamel we're gonna put this bad boy on this is the shortest chain I've ever had. This is 18 inches. I'm not used to wearing 18 inch chains. Usually I wear 20 to 24. That's pretty much every chain I have is either 20, 22, or 24 inches. But this one is 18. It's pretty short. I gotta get used to it. But it goes hard nonetheless. And this is the second to last piece. We got one more this right here is the very very last piece i'm gonna be showing today here goes that paisley 
purple grape jelly ice stout chain. Oh my gosh, bruh. This is so pretty. He also has red and blue ones on the site. It's got its Cuban cousin on the finger right there. Both of these are so shiny, bruh. But there goes that iced out paisley grape. Oh my gosh. It's so pretty, bruh. This is also 18 inches. So it is the same length as this chain right here. But I'm going to put all of these in my shirt real quick and put this bad boy on. Let's see what it's looking like. So here goes the very, very last piece I'm going to be showing today. Here goes that iced out paisley, man. I think that's how you pronounce it. I've honestly never known how to pronounce it. I just call it the bandana print. But he made the bandana print into a chain. I've never owned anything like this. And like I said, it's my first time ever getting shiny, icy stuff like this right here. So there goes the very last piece I'll be showing today. There's nothing else. I promise that is everything. I know it is a longer video, but here goes the last piece, bruh. And we're going to wrap this boy up. Man, there goes every single thing that I bought from Kuyashi Jewelry, bruh. I know it was a long video. I apologize, but there goes every single thing that I bought, man. Let me know in the comments down below. What is your favorite? favorite item that i got let me know what your favorite piece is from my video today from kuyashi jewelry my neck is fun to have muscles bruh like i already got a pretty thick neck not gonna lie but it's fun to have muscles for on this ice on it it's so heavy man i don't even know what my favorite piece is bruh i'm gonna be honest okay i do know my favorite pieces i'm playing i'm playing my favorite pieces for sure for sure Fo Sheezy My Neezy are gonna be the purple grape chain right there and then the butterfly knife chain I can't grab it just too much stuff on my neck to just grab it and show it but the butterfly knife and the purple grape chain those are my favorite man make sure to go shop Kuyashi Jewelry go follow them on Instagram go follow Connor he's got non iced out stuff like I showed today he's got iced out stuff like I also showed today he's got all kinds of stuff make sure please if you reach the end of this video go follow Kuyashi follow Connor and tell him that Juno sent you Juno sent you man but um that's gonna be it from me, bruh. Enough of me talking. I already took up too much of y'all time, bruh. But that's gonna be it. Make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe. All that good knickknack petty white. Give it like a bone. Go check out my other Mail Time Mondays. Go check out, you know, hard jewelry haul videos. My personal fears video. My unjust jewelry video. Well, it features unjust jewelry. But you know what I mean. Go make sure to go check out all my Mail Time Mondays reactions. I got gaming videos coming soon. But... That's going to be it. I'm out of here like a belly buddy. We're going to wrap it up like a burrito, man. Yurt.